Uh, this is about a man who was gang stalked and uh, yeah, you can see how good shape he was and everything and um, you're about to see all the trauma based uh, gang stalking that he went through in his community and what they did to him. So have a look at this. So. Who once looked like this, now looks like this, beaten and bloody all over a parking spot on LA's west side. But well, they ever say the attack was so brutal, the man is lucky to be alive. And tonight, police have started making arrests in the case. KKLN's Chris Holmstrom is live in Mar Vista with that story. Chris. Yeah, this is the parking spot in question. It's also where the fight happened. And if you walk with me over here, you can actually, if you look on the It all starts over nothing. And um, we also want to warn you that they'll just start gang stalking. That can be disturbing. And then um, set the target up to... Uh, get into an incident and a fight to get either locked up or driven insane and um yeah it's led to this a true goliath in the ring later becoming a neighborhood watchdog tom came out and encountered the young men and uh it proceeded to a fight this is the aftermath he suffered a broken jaw broken eye socket and concussion there was sort of a conflict over who's allowed to park in this spot this neighbor was a witness to the attack. She didn't want to show her face on camera, but this guy was gangster. Literally kicking him and punching him um, in the face and in the head. She says six men were involved, and when neighbors started to come outside, they took off. When they rushed over to Tom, she says he was incoherent. It was attempted murder. If we wouldn't have come out here, I don't know if he would be alive. To look at his face, if you saw his face right now and saw what they were doing to him, I'm really, he's really lucky to be alive. I reached out to LAPD and they tell me robbery detectives are investigating. And just this afternoon, two men were taken into custody. They are 20-year-old Justin Lee and 20-year-old DeGrate Bryant, both booked on assault with a deadly weapon. A sense of relief for neighbors, not only for their own safety, but to show their watchdog they too have his back. In many cases, you can't prove uh, that you're being gang stalked, but in this case, this guy was lucky to get catch the perpetrators. At home, Jeff and Susie will send it back to you in the studio. Chris Holmes, reporting live for tonight here on KCAL 9.